I don't mean to bother you. Most star scryers won't read their own future. We are supposed to remain philosophical about almost everything, either good or bad. But I broke the rule. Or say, I've seen it coming.
try. People are always busy on a sunny day like this. They'll talk about their riding boots, introduce their daughters, and show off their pocket watches. Me? I'm with the guy. To mean, what do you think of vessels? Does the word mean... Here to check on the progress, there is none. I'm afraid you'll leave disappointed, Madam Lucy. Send this to everyone. <gasps> this is La Unua. We must share this with everyone. La Unua Tiaclo. <laughs> Stop the transmission! The ritual is wrong! <gasps>
um, I don't mean to bother you, but I had a terrible nightmare. People are always busy on a sunny day like this. They'll talk about their riding boots, introduce their dog. Get out of 
here. A little trick. Wear gloves. Sterilize. He just here. Get out of here. I'm losing my patience. You have dumbasses. Fine. Uh oh. Oh, hi. A little trick. Побед.
Archives. They can hear it. They just hear it. A little trick. Red 38 is about to return. Someone is calling me. Leave here with me, Doctor. Let the rain wash away the old world so we can build your dream in a new one. I thought we were on the same side of liberating our oppression, giving freedom to the Arcanists. I just... I never thought that you would take people's lives, Isolde. Is this why you hesitate? Because I killed a person who shouldn't be killed? A person from the Foundation? After you befriended the young lady? Is it because you made peace with the Foundation, and yet I became associated with Magnus Vindicte? I see now. I understand, Doctor. I will correct my mistakes. Isolde? I killed a man of the Foundation. Thus, you thought I was imposing Manus Vindicte's cause over yours. It displeased you, am I right? Then I shall prove myself to you. I will take Heinrich's life, for that would make it fair. Please, come with me and witness my commitment, Doctor. What? What did you say? You're going to kill... who? Miss Angelotti, if you still don't see the big picture after returning to your true self, you are not one of us. Enjoy the sifting before the storm. Ah, Isolde, you're just in time. These two are hopeless. Goodbye, Heinrich.
People are always busy on a sunny day like this. They'll talk about their riding boots. to the headquarters. He has vital information. The mission has failed. There will be no backup. The storm canton has begun. Everyone will be called back to the headquarters. This is the night storm. How much longer will we have to wait if we miss this opportunity? Must leave at once. Marcus will have the storm syndrome if she stays here. She is losing herself. Gunshot. Isolt. Why are they here? Ah, oh, Koska, you are turning your dagger at me. Me, the one who showed you the way to salvation. Me, the one who brought you all to the Guiding One. I even pleaded with Forget Me Not to keep a spot for Kakania, for your sake. Could you do this to me? Doctor, why are you trying to stop me? You still think of me as a doctor? I can't let you do any more killing. Miss Marcus, can you get on your feet? I'll slow them down. Get Madame Hoffman to safety. There must be a better way. But how long do we have to wait for another opportunity like this? <laughs> you think you can still make it back to the headquarters? You think there will be a second chance for you? Even if we fail, Marcus will be safe. The situation has changed. Kanya's decision is the key to victory. I can't let the clues end here. This is the vice's decision.
Heinrich still alive. <laughs> He's gone. I see. I should have been faster. You must take Kanya and leave. She can protect you from his old. She won't side with manners from what I see. Give him my place in the storm shelter. Her arcane powers will be useful to us. So the both of you can evacuate safely. Did, did you plan this all along? Try, Marcus. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. I've taken back my senses before I die. I'm glad. The pain will cease. To die with my sanity and rationality still intact. <laughs> it has been an honor. No! Kakanya, can you give her first aid and take her to the station? You'll meet the Foundation there, they'll have better equipment, they'll know what to do. Heinrich is dead, but there must still be clues on him. This isn't over yet, I have to finish the mission. <sighs> Marcus, Texas. The number of that orphanage in Romania. I've had it with me for a while now, but... Please save your strength, madam. This isn't what we need to worry about. We don't have anything else to worry about. The mission is over, silly child. Bring home before the storm comes. The future is yours. I can do everything is a book everything can be read the most immediate threat to her life is that potion that was shoestring belladonna narcissus is at the roots and the fruits and roots of the picrasma tree it's the formula made by forget me not the picrasma extract makes up more than 50% of the potion this is very different from Laplace's formula. Arcanus potions seem to be a concoction of instincts and inspiration. Ah, is there nothing else I can do? The Picrasma extract is not a poison in itself, just that humans cannot... Ah, there must be a way, madam! Please! She's in pain! Don't give up. Keep breathing. I will find a way. Marcus. Every book has an end, Marcus. There's nothing more on a finished page, no matter how reluctant you are to flip that page and get to the end. You will move on to a new chapter. Forgive no, 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 me. No, 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 don't turn the page! Stop here! Stop now, please! For all the pain I had to put on you.
She was an incredible woman. Her suffering ends here. Doctor, have you decided? I must leave. But I will wait for your answer. Madam Hoffman was calm till the end. Why? Was she not afraid? No. I just read her fear through her trembling fingers. But she would not show it. She knew it would have frightened me. Repeat. This is the 24-hour countdown to the storm. All personnel must return to the headquarters. Repeat. This is the 24-hour countdown to the storm. Hoffman, this is Semmelweis. You must leave now. Last call. You know we won't wait if you miss it. The storm is coming, Doctor. Come with me to the headquarters. You can take Madame Hoffman's place in the shelter. King Midas hunted in the woods in search of Silenus, the wisest satyr. The companion of the wine god. What is the best and most enticing thing for a man? The king asked. The satyr laughed in response. Children of mischance and misery, you are asking for an answer you wish not to hear. And what is best is beyond your reach. To never be born, to never exist, to be nothing. But you still have the next best thing. Die. And do it soon. I 
I don't care if I could make it through the storm. My end is already upon me. Doctor. I'd rather die here than spend the rest of my life running from the storm. Get to safety, Miss Marcus. I still have things to do. It's a shame that we won't get to be colleagues. Zuche Naxilenos. Did Teofil write the poem in the same misery and despair? Then why did he call the painting the salvation? He set fire to every piece of his work, but why leave this one out? And this strange way of drawing? He showed the path to salvation and brought you all to the guiding one. Salvation. Salvation. Could it be? If I succeed, I can prevent the death of someone who holds the clues. Even if I die, I'll still turn Kakanya completely against Isol. This was your plan, madam? What really scared me was not the threat to my life, but the possibility of dying ignorant. I know what to do now. Doctor, wait! There might be another way. Don't fall into darkness! <gasps> Don't let madness or despair take over, Doctor. This is not the end. My mission is not over. another way to end this but it can only be done by you and me The Guiding One is merciful in bringing this era to an end before the summer of 1914. Here, the Nationalists, the Internationalists, the Arcanists, the Rationalists, the Progressives, the Conservatives, the Fanatics, the Bystanders. They indulge in passion, insisting that it is their ideals that make up the world. Who would have thought that such a progressive and sensible era would end in a barbaric war? Yet in the end, like dust, they'll be swept away and forgotten by time. Only the true believers will survive the end. But I must regretfully remind you Killing one of our own, despite your merits, is a violation of the rules. I will report this to the Guiding One.
May I have a moment alone, Mr. Forget-Me-Not? I want to look at this city one last time. Whatever you want. I've thought about this and made up my mind, Isolt. You were right. I will join you. <gasps> I have been waiting to hear this for so, so long. I know this is what you want. Now I can finally make your dream come true. I... <laughs> Before we leave, I would like to take one last walk in this world. Would you like to join me and walk to my clinic?
It's so nice to meet you. I've been waiting for so long. Hello. Welcome to the Tombstone Museum. Speak. I'm not good at dealing with visitors. It reminds me of something bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. to have come in a hurry, so there must be an emergency. Am I right? Miss Virgin, I'm arranging the travel notes from the last trip. Well, yes. Two gentlemen. See? You better really have something. See? Plappy is greeting you. Press this button and say hi to her. It's good that you're back safely.
Just like the prophecies of the woods, the scales have already been tipped in my direction.
This is groovy. Let's get on the road. It's an honor to meet you. I can hear you. Happy easy, la. Mono fissine pazai kaki kai. Funda talisman. Scientific version. Please live up to my expectations. Thunder to me. Bitch. Easy job. Whoops. <laughs> An accident. Easy. The puppy agreed with <laughs> Please live up to my expectations. needs to be made to happen. Experienced adult is coming to your aid.
Hold your horses. I'm coming. Let us get to know each other. It's an honor to meet you. It is here. Okay. Your ending is fated. Tu peux la jeter maintenant. La charme d'au père. Try this. written in the stars. Dead? Are you seeking my service? Neo Science Exorcism Office! Action! A nice job. Let's kill time together. I can hear it. Wear gloves. Tu peux la jeter maintenant. La charme de père. Freaking dumbass! 
People are always busy on a sunny day like this. They'll talk about their hiding place. place I can be. We're not allowed to go out on our own. Have you ever seen a mental patient on the stage? Or heard of a paralyzed man running about? There will be no more shows until I leave this place. No more. Hmm. Your costume is torn. Right on the chest.
hast alles gut durchdacht. Der Spiegel macht mir Angst nach dem, was passiert ist. Er spiegelt wahrheitsgetreu mein hässliches Gesicht wieder. Meine abstoßende Seele. Doktor, du bist nicht abstoßend. Wie kann jemand, der abstoßend ist, so edle, hohe Ideale haben wie du? Vielleicht. Vielleicht haben sie recht. Es ist Zeit... Das Tuch zu lüften. Das Licht tut weh. Hast du die Vorhänge geöffnet? Doktor, ich kann nichts sehen. Schauen Sie sich dieses Gemälde an, Isolde. Erinnert es Sie an etwas? Ich kann es nicht deutlich sehen, Doktor. Es ist zu hell hier. Könntest du die Vorhänge etwas zuziehen? Das ist das Gemälde Ihres verstorbenen Bruders. Die Rettung. Wir haben eine einfache Tatsache übersehen, Isolde. Bis Heinrichs letzte Worte uns alle daran erinnerten. Theophil schrieb seine Notiz in Verzweiflung, nannte aber sein letztes Gemälde die Rettung. Doktor, es ist so hell hier. Können wir woanders reden? Wie konnte ich das übersehen, Isolde? Eine noble Dame wie sie kann nicht nur singen und tanzen, sondern auch zeichnen. Theophil war ein feiner Herr, aber nur fein. Er war talentiert, aber nicht begabt. Die Frauen des Detasdorfs waren schon immer bessere Medien als ihre Männer. Sie sind viel begabter als ihr Bruder. Sollen wir euch beiden dankbar sein? Du und dein Bruder, ein paar Messiasse dieser Ära? Einer von euch schrie die Wahrheit in einem bemitleidenswerten Gedicht heraus und hielt seine Verzweiflung in Form von Kunst fest, und der andere? Doktor! Und der andere wollte die Farbe von oben abkratzen, ihre wahren Farben enthüllen und sie neu formen. Das bist du, Isolde. Du hast versucht, die Verzweiflung abzukratzen und die Welt mit deinen mitfühlenden, mitleidigen Händen neu zu formen. Er schuf die Kunst... Und du hast sie vervollständigt. Du und dein Bruder seid die Mitgestalter dieses Gemäldes, aus Mitleid für diese Welt. Und deshalb war es das einzige Werk, das den Brand überstanden hat. Habe ich recht, Isolde? Sag es mir! Mit Heinrichs Hilfe habt ihr beide den Anführer von Manus Vindicte getroffen. Ihr habt das Wunder gesehen. Euch wurde der Weg zur Rettung gezeigt. Aber der arme Theophil konnte nicht akzeptieren, was ihm gesagt wurde. Wie du wurde er von seinem edlen Blut verflucht. Er hatte Mitgefühl für die Welt, hielt aber dennoch an den Privilegien des Adels fest. Er wollte nicht mit Manus Vindicte zusammenarbeiten, aber er wollte auch keinen Krieg. Er hatte seine inneren Kämpfe. Als Begünstigter der Rettung war das Schreiben von Verzweiflung sein einziger Ausweg. Er musste sein Leben nehmen, um den Schmerz zu beenden. Und er wollte, dass du dich ihm anschließt, damit ihr beide gemeinsam von der Qual befreit werdet. Aber er übersah die Tatsache, dass du im Gegensatz zu ihm bereits in Verzweiflung lebtest. Alles, was er hatte und ihm wichtig war, hatte nie dir gehört. Die Zerstörung dieser Welt bedeutete dir nichts. Mein Kopf tut wirklich weh. Also hast du aus Mitleid den Abzug gezogen. 
Ich kann nicht sehen. Könntest du bitte das Licht im Raum dimmen? Betrachte dieses Gemälde. Schau dir diese Spiegel an, Isolde. Was hat dir der Anführer von Manus Vindicte gezeigt? Was ist der Weg zur Rettung? Ist das ein Zauber? Ein Ritual? Du bist die Einzige, die es weiß. Miss Marcus, I'll guide his old to the memory. If only this would undo my mistakes. You can do this, Miss Catania. Ich kann dich nicht sehen. Wo bist du hin? Schließ deine Augen, Isolde. Sag mir, was du von der Rettung hältst. Isolde. Nirgendwo Besonderes. Eine gewöhnliche Party. Eine Bewunderer. Schmeichler. Diese naive. Kleine. Sie erzählte in eine andere Geschichte. Hm. Vorhänge im Wind. Was passierte als nächstes? Schließ das Fenster! Schließ es! Freaking Donuts! 